In order to lower an elevation in your cholesterol, you need to understand that about 80% of the cholesterol is actually made by the body. It's not due to problems with your diet or being overweight. So for the vast majority of individuals, in order to bring their cholesterol down, they're going to need to take a medication. The cornerstone uh, medication for lowering cholesterol are statins, and there are many of them uh, on the market. Uh, lovastatin, pravastatin, simvastatin, atorvastatin, rosuvastatin. Uh, they're all called statins because they end in statins. Now, that's their generic name. Uh, they all have different uh, brand names. Uh, for example, uh, simvastatin is called Zocor, uh, atorvastatin is called Lipitor, etc. Uh, these drugs work by reducing your liver's uh, ability to make cholesterol, and these medications can all lower your cholesterol by somewhere between 30 and 50 percent. Uh, another way to lower cholesterol would be to go on a diet, but Large dietary studies have shown that if you dramatically reduce your cholesterol uh, intake, you can only lower your cholesterol about 10%. If diet and statins don't get your LDL cholesterol to go, there are other medications that you can take. Uh, one very common medication is called a Zetia or a Zetamide. This is a medication that reduces your body's uh, absorption of uh, dietary cholesterol. Another class of medications would be cholestyramine or Wellcol. Uh, these medications actually bind bile, which your body uh, needs cholesterol to make, and so your body has to uh, actually make more cholesterol because you're removing the bile. So again, the main uh, forms of therapy for high LDL are statins, and there are several uh, on the market. Uh, statins, in addition to diet, almost always get uh, you to the goal that you need.